Hello, hello, hello. This is a live, so I'm just waiting on people to come in. Thanks for joining me. Give us a second so I can make two people come in. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, Candy. Hey, I'm Bias LLC. Hey, Carla. I'm just putting everything on fake on YouTube. Go ahead. If it's your first time visiting, please um Say you're a new, new beginner. Well, a new beginner. A newbie, and I will shout you out. If it's not your first time, thanks for coming back. And I'll shout you out, too. Okay. I have 25 people in the light. Can you give them, give them thumbs up? Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. I have some mail, some goodies today. I got some goodies. I'm going to show y'all what I got today. And I'm also going to I'm also going to be Ryan, putting rhinestones on the shirt. I made this shirt. That was my last video. If you want to see how I made this shirt, check out my last video. My last live. I did a live doing this um, shirt. So check it out. Got my heat press weight um, warming up so we can get the other shirt together. Okay. Who's here? Who's here? Hey, D um, Diana. Hey, Mavis. I just told one of my moderators to pop up so we can get started. I'm so bad with letting people know I'm coming on live. I'm so bad. But today, I'm I know I do lives every Sunday or Monday. But Sunday, I'm like, let me get it out the way. Because my time is different. So I was like, I don't want to wait too late. Because when people on Facebook are getting crazy after a certain time. So I was like, let me get it out the way. Start early. Get it out the way. So what y'all doing this Sunday? This Sunday afternoon. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Kate, Katie. Okay. Hey, Charlotte. Oh, you're sewing? What you're sewing? I'm biased. I made me a couple dresses um, last week. I have some little TikTok videos on how I made my dresses. Oh, did I do it on TikTok? Or do I got some shorts? Oh, and I got I to gotta upload the video. I made a couple of maxi dresses for myself. Um, Two of them so far. I love them. I should have brought them in here. But I've been working at y'all. I've been doing patches. I've been doing a lot of orders. Uh, hi, Louise. Um, hey, big boy Prince. Hey. Um, I've been doing a lot of different things. Um, really basically trying to learn how to bling out shirts. I've been watching videos for the last... When I start something, I always start something and I don't finish until I get it right, right? So before I bring it to y'all, sometimes I don't have it right. When I bring it to y'all, I'm going to be learning too. And I just want to show y'all my mistakes so y'all won't make the same mistakes I made. So, um, lately I've been just on this bling out thing. I've been looking at different videos. I've been looking on Etsy, trying to buy, <laughs> spending money, um, buying, um, 
different uh, bling templates so I can cut it out my Cricut and put it on my own um, platform. So I'm going to show you those two that I've been doing. Um, and what else I've been doing? I've been doing patches. I've been doing a lot of embroidery um, on my six little machine over there. So check out my videos. Um, my daughter been um, begging me and begging me to make her these hoodies. So I finally got them hoodies made for her last night. And I had a couple orders for some patches done. But I'm gonna start doing some patches with bling on it, y'all. That's one thing I'm gonna start doing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check. I'm gonna get into figuring out how to do that. I mean, I learned how. I know how to do it. I just gotta find a good, um, a good image to bling out to put on the patch, y'all. So stay tuned to that. Um, stay tuned that I'm gonna be doing embroidery and blinging together too. And I know I was talking to Big Boy. He's going to do some stuff, too. So check out him, on him. Check out him. Yes, that's my shirt. Hey. <laughs> Shout out to Big Boy. He sent me this template. Isn't it nice? Because um, last my last video, I made this shirt. And I had some mail that I went. He, he sent me some more stuff, so I got this mail that I'm going to show you in a minute. But shout out to Big Boy. This is what he made. This for me. He basically transitioned it to a bling um. A bling template. I sent him a PDF, no, a PF, P, a file, PDF file, and he, he went ahead and uh, made this for me. So now I have it on my template. I'm going to show you that in a minute. I have it on my template so I can be able to go ahead and make these shirts up, y'all. Make them in different colors, make it in different bling colors. I love it. I so only had to be cut out one time. When, I like bling. So you just basically cut the um, template out one time, you have it forever. As long as you keep it up. And you just keep on just adding the rhinestones on there and heat up on the heat press and you're done with it. You can buy templates offline or you can buy the already uh, made template offline. So he went on ahead and made this for me. He was already set. Everything, I didn't do nothing to it. And um, I just went on ahead and heat it on the, on, the, um, on the shirt. So like I said, there's two different ways. I'm going to show you all in a minute. You can buy templates like this. This is what he sent me. This is a different template, but you can you, basically you can ship these to people just like this, right? I made this myself or whatever. So I made this, put the bling on there so I can just ship this to you. And all you got to do is basically put it on the, um, put on a heat press shirt. Heat press it on the shirt. That's it. That's it. This is all done. This is what I did with him. He did this for me. It was already done in the package. I just went on him and put on a shirt. That was easy it's peasy, right? But you can also get a, a um... The template, so you can you can always get this. Also, get this shipped to you. Oh, let me see. Here it is, right here. Um, shipped to you, and then you make it yourself. So this is the one right here. I just basically got two of them on here. I bought this one and I cut it out. This is unbothered. I love scriptures, y'all. I love scriptures. I want a shirt every day with a scripture on it. That's what I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna be selling all these scriptures and shirts, but not the not the templates. I'll be selling the shirts on my website because I bought these. So you cannot sell these over because I bought these templates but i can sell them on the shirts so i can sell shirts with this this images on it okay but this is the one i just showed you so i basically used this template and i made this okay i'm sorry it's sideways but yeah i made this you can use any kind of color rhinestones you want when you get it or whatever you can make you can use any kind of rhinestones so basically you just basically get this template in the mail then you just basically put the rhinestones on there then you put the plastic um I'm still getting words together, y'all. You put the plastic um, transfer sheet on top of it, and then it looks like this. Okay? So you can get it shipped to you two, three ways. This way right here. This way right here. You can do it yourself or on a shirt, y'all. <laughs> okay? But um, if you go to Etsy, um, basically they'll, they'll send you a PDF file of this. Um, they'll send it right to you, digitize it. I mean, it'll go right to your, um, you can save it right to your computer. And then that's when you have to cut it with your Cricut. Okay. And then it'll come out with this. Okay. The Cricut, it put all these, um, call these holes in there. And then, um, then you put your rhinestones on there. Okay. And then yeah, I just basically put it on this, this chipboard. So I'm showing you these. I'm going to show you some more that I have. Okay. You can sell the digital file. Too. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You can sell the digital file too, right? I'm going to show you the digital file that I'm using today and how you got to look at it to make sure it looks um, good. I'm going to show you that in a minute of the um, digital file that I bought off of LT today, okay? So, um, this was a digital this was a digital file right here. But then I um, downloaded it to my computer. Then I cut it out of my Cricut, okay? And then it turned into this. Okay, 
And I could just basically all that, and I'll basically like I do with that, just put it on the, um, take the, you'll see what I do today. I'm gonna show you how to do it today on this one design. I'm gonna be basically spreading out rhinestones on the um, template, and then I'm gonna be putting on the shirt today. Okay, this is some templates that I bought. I was gonna do this today, but I was like, no, it's too many layers, I'm gonna wait. But I've been, lately, I've been looking at a lot of different videos. Shout out to um, Dimps. She has her um, own videos about rhinestones. She's really good at doing rhinestone templates. She make her own templates. Shout out to Dimps. I also be look watching um baby booty. I'm looking at my little list because I be forgetting names, y'all. Baby baby booty. I can't think of her name, but the baby's booty. She has a she been doing rhinestones forever. Um, I seen her videos long time ago. But I was like, no, I'm not doing very rhinestones. Rhinestones are too complicated. I'm not doing it. But of course, look at me now. I'm doing it. So um, Angel B by Designs or Angel B Designs. She does rhinestones. She's really good at it. Um, do dream on. I learned how to really do the the um my rhinestones by watching her video. She got this one video on YouTube, and I watched that, and that's like, oh my god, I think I want to do it. And it was she made me speaking so easy. Okay, so do dream on. Check out her videos. Um, look at my list, y'all. Craftable things. Oh my god, she's really good too. She does everything. Um, she's really really good as when she's trying to explain something. She's like a real good teacher. Uh, let's see. I just started watching Making with Marlin. I think I got her from off of Baby Booties or somebody's page. Making Making with Marlin. Um, craftable. I mean, cr cr what is it? Crafting with Delanda. I bought some of hers. She's really good too. She's a really good teacher. Um, I bought some of her images. Okay, Crafting with Delanda. I also bought some by Coret Coretta. What is it? Simply. No, I'm sorry. Coretta. Coretta created it. My hand can't read my own hand right. Coretta created it. She has a lot on Etsy too. A lot of um different images on Etsy. And she also has video on YouTube. So check out Coretta created it. So all these women, these women, hey, I watch their videos and I've been just learning how to do rhinestones templates. I'm also, I haven't made any rhinestone templates. I ain't ready for that yet, but I will be making some soon after I figure it out and get me some time to do something like that. But lately I've just been purchasing them from um, these young women, trying, you know, trying to um, support their channel and support their um, Etsy page and their websites. And also, you can also get these off of Create Fabrica. Create Fabrica has some you can just download, download, download. I've been download, download, download everything, and I have this is what I got. Okay, so this one came from Coretta. Uh, Coretta. Uh, Coretta. God got me. Yeah, this came with from Coretta created it okay it's a lot i'm gonna do this today but i'm so scared because there's too many layers but this is one layer right here um no worries god got me right this is one layer and then you put in, in here it's an ombre okay so ombre when you have two different colors so i'll just shout it out to um big boy because i want him to send me some more bling but he already sent me something i'll show you that in a minute but i want to make sure i have different colors that like different a light green the dark green the light blue or dark blue just ombre colors or you, you could do black and gold it don't matter but this is the one um I have this one, and then this is the ombre with it right here. This is the word. You put these two words together. These two together to make it one word, but this would be a different color from this. Okay? So, that's a lot. So, I was going to do this video today, but no, that's just too much for me to do on the video. I will do this later, but it's a nice image. I, like I said, I like the, the um, scriptures. I love that. So, I just, I'm going to do a whole creation of um, scriptures on my website of shirts. Okay? So, it's all one file. Okay? It's all one file. Hope you understand that. So that this uh, these two right here, you basically put the links on there, and then you put it on here. You basically layer it on here, and it'll be two different files. This is the outline of it, okay? This is the outline of the word. Then you'll put the top and the bottom, and it'll be two different colors, and then you put all this on here. This is all. This would be all one color. Or if you don't want to be all one color, you can make it different colors. Put however you want, okay? My disclaimer, I talk, I don't talk fast when I'm excited, y'all. I'm so excited about this bling bling. So please forgive me. Y'all just listening too slow. No, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm going to calm down. Okay, this is another one. Um, this is called, this is basically, it says small business, um, the small business owner. Okay. So I basically put, this is one, this is one. I cut it out with my Cricut, of course. And I'm going to do another video and show you what um, measurements and what um, features I put on my Cricut. I'm not going to do that today. I'll show you that's another video. So um, then I put this a different color. This would be a different color. This would be a different color. And then you just basically layer this on your shirt right here. I mean, you put this on your shirt and then you put this on top of that. You layer it and then you heat press it at different three different times. Okay. Let me show you how that do how that looks. 
So this is with all together is going to say small business owner and it's different colors. Okay. This one is, I told you I've been spending money. I, I got this one off of Creative Fabrica. And I can see you can don't, download a lot of different images for free. Where well, you paying monthly, a monthly fee on it, like $4 a month. But you can download as much as you want, whenever you want, how much as you want. And you don't have to worry about nothing. Okay, so check out that link below for Creative Fabrica. Just start downloading. They have more things than um, blings. They have P, B, P, P, G, PNGs. They have SW, SWV. <laughs> I'm talking too fast. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> SVGs, PNGs. And they also have different fonts and stuff. So check out my videos on Creative Fabrica. And also check out the link below to get your um your um images. Here's another one. I made a shirt already like with this one on here. This is basically called Created with a Purpose. And then Created with a Purpose. Create, go right here. And then with a Purpose, go right here. Okay. So this is two different files. So I make it two, it's separated because you can put different colored rhinestones in there. Okay. That's why you want to separate. You, want, you don't want to mix your rhinestones. So it's separate. Okay, and this is the one that Big Boy made me. Would you say it's easier than you thought? Yes, Big Boy. If Big Boy just said, would you, did you think it was, um, hold on. This is what Big Boy made me. This is my um, logo. I sent this to him. Can y'all see that? It's big. Um, I sent this to him, and I said, can you please design, make this so I can make a rhinestone shirt? He's like, sure. So he, he basically made this for me himself. He cut it on his machine, sent it to me just like this, and he also sent me a template like this. Okay, that was already made, that was already cut out and, and put on my stone, and I made it into this. Okay? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Perfect. But the thing is with these rhinestones, make sure I'm 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 right, um, big boy. I, I can't change the size in these. It's different, it's, that's what I'm, I'm confused about. Um, a lot of these images, it'll show you the size you have to make. So my, I'm, my confusion is when I want to make a shirt, like if what if I want to make this in a kid's shirt? Okay, that's what I'm still trying to figure out. But I'm gonna make this in a, a smaller shirt. This is a medium, but it's I want to know if I can shrink it down to make it into a smaller shirt. And I heard that you can't because you cannot change the size when it comes to rhinestones because it'll mess up the holes. So let me know if I'm right or not. But how do you make it these little kids' clothes if the rhinestones have to be this? I mean, if the tip have to be this big? Help me on on that. That's the question I want. I've been asking that I've been wanting to know. Um, I emailed someone and they didn't, they never got me back with me or whatever, but I'm new to this. So I'm still learning. So thank you. She said she loved the top. notch. that's my, my brand. My son does the, um, embroidery. I mean, I'm sorry. My son does the, the vinyl on all the hoodies and stuff. He loved, this is really my son's thing with as far as the vinyl and I do the embroidery and I do the bling. Now we got bling in the session. We got the bling going on with it. Okay. So like I said, check out, um, Dimps by designs, practical things. Um, simply blessed hands also is one on Etsy. She has a lot of good um, um, designs. Baby booties, of course, she started. I mean, said she started, but she's been doing it for years. Okay, I've been seeing her videos a long time ago. It's it been like four, five years ago. And big boy just asked me, is it as hard as it seems? No, it's not. I've been doing. I've been crafting ever since COVID. And the two things I said I wasn't gonna do was bling and um, epoxy. And look at this. I'm doing. I thought this. I thought it was gonna be tedious. I was like, what am I gonna do with all them darn rhinestones? They're too little. Like, what? I'm like a mess. But it's not that hard, y'all. It's not that hard. I put myself up, like making it seem like it is. And I was watching videos back then too. I'm like, nah, I ain't doing it. Nah, I ain't doing it. So I started watching the videos again, like last week. Look at all this stuff I got. All this stuff that I'm done the last within this last week. It's crazy. He he said, once you turn the image into a blue, you can't change the size. Okay, but when you're doing Right, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. So you got to make it. So yeah, whoever makes the design has to make it for a child's um a child size. So that's what my question was. You can't change the size because it will mess up. It won't. The holes won't be big enough. I know that part, but I was just wondering like how do I make it uh, a kid size? So basically, you got to make a a certain size for a kid. You got to make a certain size for adults. Okay. Uh, make it smaller and then you can turn it into a bling. Okay, so you gotta get somebody to digitize it into a bling because it's not easy to digitize these. I mean, you get a PDF, I've been looking, I've been watching y'all, you can do, you can digitize it. Well, that's what you call it, digitize or transform it to a, um, to the D DTF, I'm sorry, to a bling font. Um, you can do it on Silhouette, for sure. I seen some, check out, um, I think, who does the, um, Coretta, Coretta, Coretta does a, on her youtube channel and um the one i'm doing today 
think her the the Delanda. Check her YouTube channel out. She shows you on silhouette how to do them. And somebody was showing you how to do them on Cricut. But it's more work to do it on Cricut. Silhouette is better, but you have to have the business edition addition to do it on um silhouette. I'm gonna get it, y'all. I'm gonna get it one day. But it's just just getting them holes together and just like uh, I better just go ahead and just buy them off of Etsy right now. Spend money. Support the support the team. Okay. Let me see what your questions are real quick before I go on. I'm gonna show y'all. What well, I'm gonna show y'all next. I have to make a list of what I need to do because I be all over the place, y'all. Um, show you what, what um where a uh, big boy sent me. Okay. She says she's trying to relax. Somebody said they're sewing today. Um. Uh, that shirt looks nice. Thank you, big boy. Very nice. Um. Hey, Anita. Let's see. I'm just trying to make sure I miss no no um. You were saying. Okay, that's it. I love that you purchased. Let me see. I love the shirt. What's your favorite place to purchase rhinestones? Big boys. I'm gonna show y'all again what he said to send me a few um and his shipping is so fast. So check out big boys print on Etsy. Um no you can't man it's fine. Okay. Okay, so let me go ahead and show y'all my bling mail that I just got in the mail. Let me get this about the way. Clean out my table because I got too much stuff on the table. Okay. My bling mail. And I just I just basically keep all my little uh big boys in me this box. Thanks for the box, big boy. I put all my little um templates in here. It's getting full, y'all. <laughs> I'm just out here making templates. So I can put them on shirts, y'all. <laughs> Um, they, they will be on my website if you're interested in buying the shirts they will be on my website which is charming gal boutique um or you can just send me a message through charming gal boutique the link is below and you can let me know what you want in your shirt and i can figure it out for you okay so let's see okay i had to open it up y'all because i didn't know he was gonna send me all this stuff y'all i was like what is this big old bag of stuff i said basically he's supposed to just, just send me one some more uh some more bling but i just thought he was gonna send me one he sent me a whole bag full of bling, y'all. So, let me show y'all the package. Look at this, y'all. More goodies for me. And I I want to use, um, I love this 10 SS's, okay? So, he sent me all the 10 SS's. We also sent me some 10, some other, some other ones too, but. <sighs> Thank you, big boy. Shout out to big boy for sending this in the fast, 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 fast time manner. I, it was here. Like, I'm ready to... And I didn't... I wanted to make some shirts. I was like, no, I'm not going to open them until I show y'all what he sent me. So, I ain't made no shirts with these brand new ones that he sent me already. But I have so many different rhinestones now. It's hard to open because I got Vaseline on my hands. But look at this, y'all. These colors are so pretty. I can't... I don't want to... Mm, I don't know how I'm going to show y'all these colors. Can y'all see that through the... Oh, yeah, I see like that. Okay. So, look at that. Can y'all see that? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to flip the camera so I can show y'all better. Now, if I flip the camera, then I ain't better... Stuff. Let me open it all up and then I'm gonna show y'all. Okay. Look at that silver. Can y'all see that? You can see it. Yeah, a little bit. Okay, there you go. There you go. That silver is blinging. Oh my gosh. I love it. I'm gonna show y'all just like that. I'm not gonna, gonna waste my time doing it the other way. But this is the um check out him. Check out Big Boy Prince. This is the um C A B. Um Crystal and uh, Crystal A B. Oh, I got the names right here, y'all. He can give you a list of stuff that he send you. Okay, very professional, very professional. So this is the crystal um rainbow. Okay, this is the color I just showed you. Right there, that's the E E M, which is M Royal Green. I think no E M. Yeah, M Royal Green. These are all STNs, and I there's there's more sizes, but this is what I want to go for. MS um, ten SM. What is it? Ten SS. SS ten. Yeah, I see that. This is uh, that's uh, so hard to open. Cr. Let me see our crystal rhinestones. What's we'll Cr crystal? I don't know. There's another color. Tell me if y'all can see it good. Or should I do it a different way? I have the, um, this is a purple. Purple. Oh my God, I love purple. I think I'm gonna do the purple today. Uh, did I do purple already? I might do purple today, y'all. 
So he sent it, he sent these to me. I didn't even know he was sending them to me. Thank you, big boy. Check them out. I'm thinking I'm gonna use purple today because it's my favorite color. No, I'm using a pink shirt. So let me know what color I should use, y'all. I'm gonna be using this shirt. But I'm showing y'all the colors. I'm using this shirt. Okay. And this is the um template I'm gonna be using. Certified C C C O. So let me know what color. I'm gonna use two different colors. Probably, um, well, I can use three different colors. I could use three different colors. One color for the CEO, and then she goes into right here. They can go another color, and then certify is going to be on top. This will be another color. So let me know what three colors I should use today, y'all. Put in the comment below what colors I should use. Okay. Here's a red color, which is the light. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's bright. I don't want to use red today, but that's a nice red. I'm not a red girl, but I mean, I'm, I'm mixing stuff that's red, but I like silvers. I like purples. I like rose gold. Uh, this is another red. This is two different reds, though. This is HY, which is uh, like an orange. or oh, just like an orange. But it looks red. And this is the um the red one. Oh, I'm dropping stones, y'all. Can't be dropping stones. There's my purple heart. Yes, I love purple. Me too. Happy Sunday, y'all. Brew and Royal Creations. This is a black. I never used black before, y'all. I just never thought black would bling. But I think I'm going to try black so I can see it blinging. <laughs> I don't know yet. Just let me know what color y'all think. I need three colors, y'all. Go ahead and let me know what color y'all need. So should, I, should I use? Here's a blue. Y'all can see a blue through here. Blue is not hard to see. But you can see them glistening if you put the heat on there, okay? That bling bling. Put the heat on there and then you can see how... Um, where is my dang gone? Monitor is at. Come on, it's a spider behind me. Don't scare me like that. I ain't playing. Um, Here's a silver... Okay, so these are the ones I'm going to be using. I don't know what I'm going to be using yet, but um, let me know what color I should be using, okay? Oh, he sent me more stuff, y'all. He sent me more stuff. Okay, it's more. More, more, more. I think it's the same colors, though. Let me see. JB. Or these different colors, big, big boy. Oh, yeah, they're the same colors, but he just gave me, sent me more. So he also sent me this. She said blue, purple, and black or silver. Blue, purple, black, and silver. Okay, I'm going to see. That sounds good. So this is another pack of those. And then um I got some um, S6 um SS6. Okay. <laughs> okay, so these are smaller. I probably I said I would never use SS6, but I probably have some designs that need SS6 on there. So thanks again, big boy. Check them out on Etsy. Okay. Put this away for right now. And let's see what colors y'all told me to use. Blue per only one person said something. Blue, purple, and black. But on a pink shirt, um, I think I'm going to do blue, black, and silver. I mean, I'm sorry. Purple, black, and silver. Purple, black, and silver. Okay, so I think I'm going to do purple, black, and silver. So let's find those colors. Purple, black. On this pink. I hope it sh that purple shows good on that pink shirt. Where's my purple going? Purple. Don't look like it's purple. Purple, black. Yeah, it's, it's like a purple. It's like a rose gold. This is like a rose gold to me. So I'm going to use the whatever it is right here. Okay, so let me put these back in the bag. I'm going to go ahead and start spreading. My heat press is warming up. Oh, I've got to be the silver. It's the baby. Okay, so let me put you over here. I have 48 people watching. Can you go ahead and put the thumbs up? That's what we're going to do today with these, these shirts, y'all. 
Oh, sorry, I gotta put my phone on the tripod and it's kind of hard. You do. Hope y'all can still hear me. Hey, Dimps, thanks for coming. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm praying that you show up, Dimps. These people on here are crazy. <laughs> I need my moderator in here. So much more I see a black spider if guy hit me over here scared. <laughs> so please, thanks. I was praying. You must have heard my prayer, Dimps. Jesus. Facebook be off the hook. Shout out to Dimps. She came in and saved the day. You get all these people out here that's wanting to be acting rude on Facebook. You know how y'all do it. I'm happy to see you, Dimps. I just shouted out. She, um, Dimps is the one I'll tell you about. She has her own, um, she had a website, Dimps Design, and she does bling bling templates. So check her website. I'll put your link in there, Dimps, for me. Okay. This is the shirt we're going to be using for y'all that just came in. This is the shirts we're going to be using today. Um, I got this from uh, Walmart. <laughs> I love Walmart shirts for myself. And I like them because a lot of times they're cheaper. They even cheaper on on, on some um, on some of these websites to go to Walmart than go to these websites. So yes, I've been going to Walmart because I like the colors and I can pick them out and get what I want. And I like the way they cut the shirts. They're tight. They're fitted. So I like all that. Okay. And you can drop all of them, Dimps. Drop all of them. Okay. So um, I'm gonna put my shirt over here on the heat press. Just to sit here while I um get my tent my templates together. So like I said, in the beginning of the video, you can get your, you can get these templates off of, um, these designs off of Etsy, but then you would save it to your computer, and then you will, um, cut it out on your cutting machine. You could do a, uh, Cameo, your Cricut, or whatever cutting machine you have. You got to set it in your, your, um, t your, um, settings, what you need to set it as. And these templates will tell you. Before you cut it out, it tell you what um, size it have to be, and also tell you what stones you can use. I just want to show y'all really quick. Okay, that's all I'm gonna show y'all. Just one second. So this is the tip that I'm using today, and this is off of Etsy. Okay, and it tells you right here, right here. You see this right here? It says this how many stones it's gonna be using. And then it tells you what size you have to make it right here, which is 10.2 by 5.4. And then you have these 10, 10 SS for, um, stones, okay? Oh, so it's telling you right here, it's got, um, they had told you what silver, how many silver it's going to be using. And it also is telling you that the, T, the, T, the silver is the 10 SS. And then it's telling you how many pinks you have to use. And it's also 10 SS. So with me, I cut it into three different, um, di different, um, Images so I can have certify a different color and I can have CEO a different color. And I'm gonna put she a different color. So I'm gonna put the sheet. I'm gonna put let me think. Certified was going to be let me see. Uh hmm. Certified will be purple. No, 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 no. Okay, let me think. <laughs> I think I'm gonna do CEO silver. The she will be purple. And the certified to be black. What y'all think? What y'all think? I don't want. I don't want the certified to be black. I don't think I want black. What y'all think? Ooh, I'll do the CEO black. I put uh, certified would be silver. The she would be purple. And then the um, I'm putting my, my stuff right here. I'm trying to get what I, my mind ain't working. Silver. Damn, what I just say? <laughs> CEO would be black. Okay, so CEO black. The silver would be the um shoot. <laughs> Certified. <laughs> I'm so complicated with myself. And then the purple would be the, the she. Okay, silver and purple. Yes. So no black dimps. Hey, Craftable Things. I was showing you out too. Check out Craftable Things video. I was telling y'all earlier. She's really good with showing you how to bling bling things. Look, bling bling things. <laughs> Everything else, you do a lot of things too, but um, her videos are really uh, she really I'm, I just love how she's so she demonstrates so well and she explains it so well that you really understand the first time. Okay, so this is what I'm doing. I got it all cut out, and t them said I should just use the uh, silver and purple. Okay, I can. Mm. Okay, I'll take the black out because I'm thinking black was kind of dark. But somebody else said use a black, so sorry. I'll just go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and use the pink and purple. Just keep it simple. Keep it simple. No, you said silver and purple. What did you say? 
It's silver and purple. Okay. So I'm going to basically go ahead and put this all the certified CEO in, um, in um, silver. And I'm going to put the sheet in purple. Okay. That's what we're going to do now. So I'm going to go ahead and do the sheet first. get out the way so here we go so what we're going to need for this basically you have your template and I, I cut this out on Cricut I'll show you how my settings and everything in another video but I got this cutting board from Dollar Tree and this flat this flock came from um oh, I got another package I can show y'all this also came from, with big, from big boy he sent this to me too thank you um I get my flock and my transfer sheets I'm going to transfer tape from Big Boy. I'm going to show you how this looks so you can know how it looks. The flock is very sticky. And some people you some people cut their flock out on the mat without the white backing. I cut my flock out with, without the backing. Some people cut it with on the backing because it's easier to clean up if, if you cut it on the backing with the backing on. But I cut it without the backing because it's such a good cut. Whenever I cut myself, I have no dots left behind. Okay? Do you understand what that means? Basically, when you cut it out, some of the dots gotta be um all the dots should be holes like it should be like this. It's, all the holes should be clear from having the little dots inside of them. All mines come out perfect. With me cutting it, my thing's gonna fall with it when it fall. With me cutting it without the backing, okay? So this is the oh he's seeing a lot of this. Thank you. So this is the transfer sheet that I use. I get it from big boys. I'm like, where's my flock? Here he is. This is wrapped up in here. And also the flock is in here. I'm out of my other flock. I just used it all the other day. So I was like, I know I got some more coming. I can't get it out of here. But it's wrapped up in here real tight. Hold on. So get oh, here he is. Here's the flock. Mine is, is blue. Okay. It's they, Some come with pink. So this is blue. And this is the backing. Okay. Some people cut theirs with the backing on the mat. You put it on your Cricut mat and use the backing on. I literally take mine off, okay? And when you take it off, the backing is very sticky. Very, very sticky. So I hate my hands being sticky, but I love it because it sticks to the mat. Even though the mats have glue on it already, I'm like, I mess my mat up. It won't mess your mat up. I just get my little scraper, which I have it somewhere. I've been using it. Oh, I can show y'all one thing right now. I have my scraper and I scrape it off, okay? It's, it can get a little messy, but people, like I said, why people use the mat use the paper on the back but I tried to use the paper on the back and mine didn't cut out right so I just keep stable what I know I can keep on paying my settings and do it like that but I like it like it is okay I just use it with the um back and off let me show you how it looks let me show you how it looks this is basically how it looks my dang one thing keep on falling stay this is a scraper I use from big boys he said he did a whole um template package a starter kit and he gave me this and a whole lot of different tools on my first video i can show you what he gave me so check out my first video and i'll show you everything he gave me this right here is <laughs> something i was doing yesterday i didn't finish cleaning it off yet but this is how it's supposed to look after you finish cutting a template all the dots are on your mat okay and all you gotta do is take the scraper and just scrape it you basically just go like this i can't do it right now because it's going on my floor but i just scrape it real hard and it'll come all off okay but it's sticky so you gotta get paper towel wipe it off so this is how it looks when you if you, if you cut up image off you pull off, you pull off the flock tape flock off the flock and then the the left the little holes it be left on the um on the mat okay then your flock will be filled with holes like this okay so I would there's a lot of videos out there to show you how to do that but I will be showing the video soon how to do that also okay. So let's go ahead and get this shirt together. My heat press is ready. So this, this thing will take a, while, a, a long time at all. I have, I, Big Boy gave me this, but in the, um, in the uh, starter kit. But I also seen people be using these. I got this from a dollar store. You can get it from your, um, I got it from Walmart. But you can also get it from Lowe's or your handy store. It's called a paint trimmer, okay? So I'm gonna test this out and see how it works because this is nice and it's good. But I just want to see how this works. Everybody been using this too, okay? You also gonna need a um. I said nice and good. Good, get my get get it together, Charmaine. Also, you're gonna need, need a um a wax pencil. I really don't use this wax pencil because to me, when I put the rhinestones in a wax pencil, it sticks on the, on the wax pencil and it won't come off. So 
I've just been using tweezers. I like the tweezers better. Okay, I like pick it up and drop it. Pick it up and drop it. Okay, that's what I've been using. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the, the word she. But I'm gonna cut off this first so I can have enough right here. That oh, when is it cut? Yeah, I'm gonna cut it off so I can have this and have enough to have for my word she. Because I don't wanna put all this um rhymes with at the same time because you can mix them up and I'm gonna give you stuff. So this is a good way when you have different um images, different words, you can just go ahead and put it to the side when you get done with it and you come back to it. Okay? So can y'all see that? Is that good close enough for y'all? Okay, so I'm going to be using the she is going to be purple. I'm going to go ahead and open this up. If y'all have any questions, let me give me a second before I um, answer them because I'm trying to get this together. I'm going to be here all day. We got somewhere to go at 3 o'clock. So I heard that if you put a lot of them on there, it's better to put a lot of rhinestones on at one time. Oh, man, I need to put my... I I usually go put a mat on, on my table, but my table is clean, so if I ever need to use anything, I can just wipe them up. But I also got this from... um This whole... Everything in this little container came from the starter kit from Big Boys. Okay? So these things, I don't know if these four, I figured out the phone game, scissors, he gave me all kind of stuff. So check out the starter kit for your brain from Big Boys. This is what he gave me. So I can just scoop it in there and put it back in my container. And he also gave me a um, brush to go with, okay? <laughs> little brush, little dust brush. Okay? But what I'm going to do is, I went to Michael's. I'm always shopping. I went to Michael's and got these containers right here. So I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put all my container like these little small ones. I'm gonna go ahead and put them in here so I can have them, so I can see how much I have instead of having little tiny ones. I'm gonna just put them in this big container so I can see how much I have so when I'll be able to know when I gotta order some more stuff, some more bling. Okay, so let me go ahead and try this and see how this works. Okay. Oh, kind of works kind of good. It's only a, well, like a dollar or something. It takes a while, but I mean, oh, it always. It, oh my goodness. <laughs> Cool. Okay, so I'm gonna just talk a little bit while I'm doing this because it takes a sometimes it takes a while to get these um, stones in there. I don't want to be so quiet. Oh, this didn't take long at all because it's because it's a small word. So you can circle the motion, you do however you want to. I just go back and forth with it, and there it's, it's done already, y'all. So I like this little brush. <laughs> it's not saying the other brushes that doesn't work, but maybe just because I don't know. I don't want to be here all day on, on the video and say, let me just go ahead and work right for you. So, so I just put them over here on the side. Let me get an increase of the dang on table right here that I have. Ah, good job, Charmaine. <laughs> so I just wipe it off and see, make sure I get all the ones I don't need off. I'm going to put it onto the side. Okay, so I only got a couple of three of them, to, four of them to do with my um my tweezers, okay? So that was quick. Okay, for my little thingy thingy. My little tray. Set it right here. So I'll get my tweezers and go ahead and pick the three that I have to put on here. Can y'all see that, y'all? Is it close enough? Let me know if I got need to. Oh, okay, there. Okay, so let me ahead and put my tweezers on here. And y'all, it's been crazy because now my vision, oh my god, when you get oh, when you get over 40. The vision just wanted to just leave you, leave you, leave you. And I was like, I, before when I was a little kid, I always wanted to wear glasses when I was younger. See, I want to wear glasses so bad. Now I have to wear them. I'm like, oh my God, I can't see y'all. So this bling thing, people say, it's so um soothing. <laughs> For me, it's soothing when I'm doing, when I'm putting it on like cups and stuff. But this right here is so teeny because it's so small. The ones I put on cups is not this small. So it's my eyesight that makes me like, oh my God. This is like, oh my goodness. But, uh. I can't see y'all. Even with my glasses on. So why is this doing this? My um tweezers is having they stick it to my tweezers because I got some glue in there or something. And that's why I like to use the wax pen because the wax pen sticks it and you can't get them off. But I but a lot of people use the wax I use the wax pen for my um my cups and stuff because they're bigger. It's easier to use them. But for this, I I rather use the tweezers. I do um tumbler, I mean I do um wine glasses. I do the um, mugs, bling. Check the, I have a video on that too. On how to put bling 
on your mugs and your um wine glasses. Matter of fact, I just had a video. I just did a, a, a glass for a client, a customer, the other day. Come on now. These, like I said, these can be so teased when you can't see. Okay, so this one I think is done. Can y'all see that? Everything looks good on here. So now, let's make sure. Okay. So now I want to make sure. I'm going to put the plastic on here. The transfer paper. I have 40 people watching. Is it 23? 53 people watching. Can you give me the thumbs up, please? You can reuse. I didn't know you could reuse this. When I first started, I was throwing this away. But I found that you can reuse these over and over again. So this is the old one I used before for my other shirt that I made. So yes, you can reuse these, okay? The uh, transfer sheets. You lay it on top. Okay. Then you smooth it on there. One of mine's smooth. If, you, if it moves, you can move it with your finger. Your fingernail. I'm going to rub this on here like this. You can use a little roller thing too, but I don't have one. Let me see what you're saying. Let's see. Uh, anything, anyone say anything? I'm just looking and see. I don't know. See from this okay, I don't see anything. What else do you want? Drop just like oh. Okay, if you have anything, if I miss anything, let me know. AJ Star, thank you for the super chat. Three, thank you, AJ Star boy. Thank you. Um. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. So I just went on here and just smooth this out so you make sure these rhinestones don't stick into your um transfer sheets. And then you just basically pull it off and then we go to the next color. Okay? We're gonna do the next two gonna be silver. Okay. Let me know if y'all think of a different color, because I wouldn't mind doing three colors. But I don't know about the black, because black is kind of dark. But I, I'm just but even before somebody said black, I'm just so biased. Well, so like, hmm, black bling bling, but I just seen so many different shirts people have been putting these on black. So I'm like, ooh. I need to get out my comfort zone and just try black. It just seems like it'd be so dark. Look at that, y'all. See how easy that came out? Can y'all see that? <laughs> it came out perfect. Look, every stone was on there. So you don't have, have to worry about it. But if it didn't, if all the stones wasn't on there, it basically, you could just basically um go back and put it back down and do it over. So that's done. Put it back on the back of the um sheet that it came off of. And put that to the side. Okay? Put that to the side. And now we're gonna go ahead and do certified. So I'm gonna go ahead and use silver, right? Let's see. Ah, that's the purple. Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and use silver. Certified. I wanna do a different color, y'all. Purple, silver. Certified. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put CEO on black. I'm gonna go ahead and do black. I'm gonna go ahead and get out my cover zone and I'm gonna use black, y'all. Okay, I thought black would be too dark, but I'm gonna use black. It's somebody the first person that told me they want to use black, they told me to use black. So I'm gonna do certified first though, because it's right here. And you can also put um tape right here if you want to close this up, so it won't be the black the um, bling won't get on here. But I, I'm okay with that. So I'm gonna leave it alone because you could use painter tape to cover this up, but I don't need that right now. I'm gonna put certified in silver, and since that pink, the she word is gonna go inside the certified, I'm gonna make the certified black, okay. So I'm going to try it out. We're going to try it out. So here's the silver. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to go slow because I don't want to splatter it everywhere. Okay. I'm going to use this brush again. It's pretty cool. Circle motion or you go back and forth with it. This is going to take a little more time probably y'all because it's way more letters than the she was. So we're going to just figure it. We're going to play around with it and hopefully it don't take forever to get these rhinestones in here. Okay. I'm a newbie at this, and like I said, once I start something, I love doing it, and I don't stop. <laughs> like I said, I, in the beginning of this video, you'll see all the um, rhinestone pins that I cut out with my Cricut. If you missed that part, go back and ch check it out after this video is over with, this live is over with. I did a lot of different um, templates within this last week. I've just been on just shopping, y'all. Shopping, shopping, shopping on SC. I, I named the people that I got some, the stuff from. I mean, just see, this. I'm messing up. Um, the stones are coming back out of it. Um, a lot of got them from Etsy. I even looked at videos. Different people. I shouted y'all out on on um 
and let you know where I got the stones from and also where I watched videos on how to um, do different things as far as putting the bling on the shirt. Yeah, this is not, not doing good. These are way smaller. Some people say you circle it, circle it. The first one did good. This one's like, uh, don't want to go into the holes. I got a lot to do, y'all. Let me try to. Too many. Okay, um. Can y'all see that? Am I in the camera or no? No, I'm not. Why did I tell you I was in the camera? <laughs> Sorry. Okay. See how many holes I have left? I got to um, sprinkle back on them. I'm going to take these purples and put them back in here. Now, I don't want to mix y'all your, your, um, stones. Sorry, I was in the camera, y'all. I got to start paying attention to that. But, um, go ahead and put these back in here. Be careful because these things do jump. Try it again. Okay, let me try this brush this time. Let's see if it's gonna be better for me. Like I said, some people think this is soothing. I don't, <laughs> cause I can't see. But it, but uh, till you stay on. But I'm a, I'm not gonna stop doing it because I'd rather do this than purchase them already made because I wanna do it myself and I can pick out what colors I want or whatever. Sorry, but I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm not gonna stop, but just just putting these beads, I mean these little things in these little holes. Mm. It's okay. Okay, so now I'm going to just um wipe away the ones that I don't it's not fitting on it. I'm gonna just whatever I don't have but on here I'm gonna have to do it myself with the um it's a lot of it's way more than it was before. Jesus, Jesus, take the wheel. Oh, that one be good. Okay. It's going to be way more to do with that CEO. Hope it's not boring, y'all. I'm not trying to make y'all bored. <laughs> but I just got to get these stones on here. Okay, I'm going to rub everything off with it. Or if it's not on there, it's not on there. I'm just going to do them. One by one. Um. Okay, see how many I had to see y'all, what y'all talking about. <sighs> that would be me, Charmaine. This is not soothing. I would be pulling my hair out. I can't see. <laughs> this, this, this is not soothing. I'm sorry. I always struggle with choosing the colors. Me too. I'm really not good with uh, choosing colors. Uh... He said, use the black. Yep, I'm going to use the black. Okay. So, I'm going to stop looking at what y'all saying because I need to get this done, y'all. I'm going to be on this video all day long. So, let me go ahead and get my tweezers and start dropping them like it's hot. Oh. It's a lot of them. Like I said, I'd rather use the tweezers. Y'all see that? I'd rather use the tweezers because, um, the, the, uh, I can't use the dog on wax pick. I use the wax thing for my cups, but not for this. It seemed like it would be much better to use with this, but let me try it. Let me try it. Maybe I can, if I tip it a certain way, it would be so much quicker. See? Ugh. What's tipping is not on. Oh, let's try it. Let's be good. Okay. We got to wipe the wax pick pencil off. Okay, then wax pencil show off then. Please show off. I can't tell you to show off. Because I... Don't want to be on this video all day. Good job. It's working for me. Working for my good. <laughs> no, it's not. Now it's not doing it. The thing is, it, it sticks on it. And I don't want it to, I want it to be up there. 
Sometimes it do what it, it, what it do. Can y'all see that? I always use, like I said, that's probably my third time saying it, but I always use this for my um my mugs and tumblers. That's soothing to me, okay? That's soothing. I can sit in my bed and I can get a wine glass and I can get my beads and I put on some a TV show and I just sit there and do it because those beads are bigger. And those beads, uh, you just pop, 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 pop all over the place. Then I just, I just did, I did one, but um, I sold it, so I had to ship it out. But it's so much easier to um use the bigger beads. These things right here, girl, I can't see these things. I can't see little holes. And on the cups and stuff, you just basically um on the wine glasses, you basically just print out some um vinyl um from your Cricut. You cut it out, and now you do the Afro girls, the Afro women, the hair, or whatever. And I just bling out their hair, so their hair is big. You know what I'm saying? So I get the big big stones, put it, fill it with their hair, and just put it anywhere. You just get the glue, wipe the glue all over the over the one vinyl, and then you start pitting, pitting. And you just start putting uh, <laughs> rhinestones all in the hair. You know what I'm saying? But they're not this tiny, and it's I love that. That's soothing. But this one her, it might get better for me. The hook, as long as as long as this thing work right here, I'm 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 good. It's working for me today. Last time I used them, I'm like, oh, hecky no. Nah. They didn't want to cough the dang on um, the stick off the um, pencil. I'm like, you won't go. Almost done, y'all. Then we got to do CEO. So I pray that that one is going to be uh, better than this one. Because before, I um, when we did the bird, she, we only had like four different holes that wasn't um covered. So that went well. I was happy. See, this one right here, that one, come on. So the CEO is gonna dump the whole black on there, so we hopefully that because it said the more right you um lip put on there, the quicker is you can put the holes on there. So I gotta use my thing. I can use this to get them off because this sometimes it sticks, sometimes it don't. So if I get stuck, I just go ahead and use this little um tweezers. Lord, how do you um? Probably if you, if you wipe the um, wax pencil on your shirt or something, maybe that'll keep it from being so not so sticky. You want it to be sticky, not this sticky. You want it to stay to the dang on mat. Okay. I'm almost done, y'all. Go ahead and um, like this video. Like I said, I got this from, um, I think, oh, I gotta let y'all know. I'll be forgetting. Uh, crap. What is it? I wrote it down. <laughs> Off of Etsy for, uh, what's her name? Start with a C. Coretta. She is, I love doing um scriptures and stuff like that, verses and stuff. Christian biblical words, inspirational words. I love doing all that. So that's what I'll be doing. And hopefully, some one day I make my own. Okay, just getting more in y'all. Hey, everybody that joined, if you're a newbie, go ahead and shout your name out. Um, and I'll shout you out when I get to see what's going on. But I'm almost done with this. And after we do this, I'm going to do the CEO. And then we're going to go ahead and put it on the shirt. And we'll be done, y'all. Uh, check out my Etsy page, Charming Gal Boutique, number two. Um, I love doing, I love designing personal things for people. Personalizing images and see my holes. Um, okay, I'm done, y'all. Let's just check it out to see because my eyes is like working sometimes. It seems like, oh, there's a kind of move that one over. Uh, uh, I think that's it. I think that's it. So let's move this one over a little bit right here. Where did it go? I just said right here. Push that in there. There. This is so crazy how you um cricket can cut these little holes out for you. Can y'all see that in there? Oh my gosh. Let me put these up so y'all can be able to see it better. Um cricket can cut these holes out and it takes a little while though, y'all. Sometimes it does take depends on how big the image is. Cricket takes a while for it because you got these little old tiny, tiny holes. And that's always like, oh my god, I gotta do this when I back in the day when I was gonna start um and that was another thing I was scared of. I was scared of not being able to find the settings, the right settings. 
and cricket. That's another thing that helped me back from doing this years ago. I'm like, what if I don't have the right settings? I'm going to mess up all this flock and stuff. So I had a lot of things that I, that was um, pulling me back from doing this, y'all. The settings, the, the, the beads were small and just making the mess and what if it don't stick and blah, blah, this, blah, blah, that. It was, all, it was always something to keep me away from doing blings. But now I tried it. Not bad at all, y'all. Not bad at all. Was this long enough? Nope, it's not long enough. Mm, nope. I don't know. So I'm going to go ahead and get another piece. Cut that out. I did that before I put it on the paper. But I didn't. So basically I take this right here. About this size. Cut it. Can y'all see me? My thing just want to do what it want to do. I don't even understand. I just bought it. My son broke it. So he was swearing down that he didn't break it. So I'm like, what? I didn't break it. Talking about my, my, um, I'm just cutting this out. My little thing that holds my phone. So I just take the plastic out, take the top off of it, and put the plastic on here. I'm going to say I'm plastic. The, um, let me cut it a little bit. It's too long. But it don't matter. Can y'all see that? Just drop it on there. Ah! Of course, on the freaking video, I'm, ah! Sorry, y'all. I, I, oh my God. <laughs> I've never done this. I never messed up on this ever since I've been doing this. And of course, on the freaking video, I messed it up. And I ain't gonna do it over. I ain't gonna do this. I ain't gonna put it in there like this again. This is the first time I ever did this, y'all. This is the first time I ever messed up. Jesus Christ, help me. Oh, my God. Just being, trying to be alert because I'm on the freaking video. <sighs> I think I'm going to keep it on. I'm not about to do all this again. I'm not about to do this again. <laughs> I'm saying it, but I might have to do it again. Frigian Fuji's Frickers. And I want to cut so bad, but I don't. Lord knows I can't see. <laughs> I'm just about to do it and take it off and do it over. This is ridiculous. I never, ever, ever. I mean, I've been doing. I've been doing these right well. I've been doing, I did like five of them, and I never messed up with this. And I've been seeing how people be like, just drop it, just drop it. You know, video, just drop it, just drop it. I'm like, it's not that hard. <laughs> and look what I do. So just, oh my God. This is my shirt. So let me see how bad it looks. I'm looking at it through the plastic. Oh, it's jacked up. Oh, it's jacked up. The, the, the certified, the, the first three letters is cool, but when I get to the D, oh, it's jacked up. <laughs> so I'm going to throw this away. Let me just show y'all. Can y'all see the, the C, the E, and the R, the T, and the I, and the I is okay. Then the F, I, E, D is jacked up. <laughs> I'm definitely keep from crying because these just got to go in the garbage. Every time I do a video, I always mess, not always, but I mess up. You know what? I can still, no, I ain't about to do that. I could use, the, I still could use the C, the R, the F. I'm going to go ahead and, shoot, I can't even see. I think I'm going to go ahead and still use the, uh, <laughs> Charmaine, Charmaine, Charmaine. I ain't going to do this. Dang. I can't see. That's the problem. What should I do, y'all? Should I just go ahead and do it over? <sighs> I think I'm gonna cry first and then do it over. It's okay. Just scrap the stones. Oh, scrape and scrap. Scrape them off. Did it come off? I didn't know they scrape off the plastic. I didn't know that. Okay, so I'll just do that to do that later. I didn't know they come off the plastic, y'all. I'm over here having a fit. But I didn't know that they, I didn't know I can get them off the plastic. So I'll just leave that there. Do this over. Oh my god. Sorry. Hope this goes a little bit faster than the first time. I'm a little ADHD, y'all. Uh, I go crazy for no reason. I'm hot too. This dog when he presses got me hot. 
I'm just sweating, trying to get these little things in here. No, I can't see. <laughs> this is a lot for me today. Off my comfort zone. So, look at this. This many bones we can get in here. Circle of motion. I'm going to do this over again. And this time, we're going to just throw that thing down there and let it fall. But thanks for telling me that. I didn't know you can um, scrape the dang stones off the plastic. I thought it was over with. I just want to say on plastic, it's the transfer tape. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't mind doing this. I mean, it's okay to do these. But I don't like doing a video. Because I don't want y'all sitting here waiting. And I'm just, I'm just I'm rushing, trying to get it done. That's why I'm messing up. I don't like having long videos. I know y'all might have better things to do than watch me. <laughs> so that's probably the reason why I'm like, uh. But if I, I was at home and I'm chilling at home doing it by myself without y'all watching me. It's okay. It's not that bad, okay? It's not that bad. But right now, I just don't want to have this video to be so long. And I know this takes time to do it, so it has to go with the flow. Oh, it's not like better when I just drag it across it like that. It seems like it does better. So let me try it over and just drag it across it. Because look, all these letters are done. I just got a couple. Oh my God, y'all. Y'all didn't tell me I was in the <laughs> I'm messing up this whole video, y'all. I'm messing up this whole video. Rhinestones and videos is not good for me. I know you're probably like, Charmaine, we don't see you. We see your shirt. Sorry. Again, I done had like three stories on this video. Forgive me, for I am not perfect. I will not try to be. So let's try this again just by dragging it across. It seems like it's better instead of doing a circle of motion, just drag the um, rhinestones across the page, the, uh, the design. So let's see if that works better. Y'all probably laughing at me for real. I'm laughing at myself. It's okay. <laughs> but what I did like this, it seems like it works better when I just drag it across like this. And it kind of did. Okay, I got a couple more holes to fill. They're not as bad as the first time, I don't think. Probably like about the same amount I had the first time. I'm just, I'm just brushing off the top one. That, you can use your finger just to rub over it too to make sure there's nothing. It should stay in there, which they do. Okay. So I have a few more to put on there, y'all. And this time, I promise, I'm going to promise y'all that I'm going to put this, I'm going to make it work this time. So y'all want to see me over, do it over again. Because that's the point. I would not be doing it over again. This video will be over with. Because <laughs> I am not the one. We keep on messing up. Okay, where's my uh, pen? Of course, I can't find it. Did I drop it? Um, I don't see it. Let me be quiet for a minute, y'all, so I can get this together and get it done. My mind is overwhelmed because I'm messing up. And I don't like messing up. But you can always check my videos out and see all the mistakes I've made. So you're going to make the same mistakes I've made. So this is a lie. And usually when you're at home doing things, you, it don't go perfect. So it's gonna mess. you're going to mess up. Even though you know what you're doing, you're still going to mess up. Sometimes, shoot, just popping all over the place like my car. Like I said before, I like to use the um, I like to use the tweezers better than the um, the pen because the pen sticks too much for me and I can't get the thing off. Thanks for y'all this this day to continue to watch me even though I messed up. <laughs> I probably can leave the camera and come back and I'll still be here. Make sure I'm in the camera. Look at the camera. Make sure y'all saw what I'm doing. Seeing what I'm doing because I'm almost done, y'all. Then I gotta do the CEO, which is a lot more rhinestones. Then I'm gonna put on a shirt. What time is it? Shoot. I 
have an appointment to go to at 3 o'clock. So I have to be out here at 3. So hopefully the shirt will be done. Okay. Fudge. We're going to 2 o'clock. Okay. Okay, let's see. I got about five more to do, y'all. Take my time and get it right. Like I said, when I was a kid, I always wanted to wear glasses. No, I can't stand it. Look at that. 20-20 vision. No, my vision jacked up. <laughs> and it's so hard to try to see. It's so hard to see and you can't see. Very frustrating. And I just got these glasses. I still can't see. Okay, stop rambling. Okay, I definitely got one more to do. This one gotta come up. Uh, come on now. Put that one right there. Okay, I think that's it, y'all. You gonna see that in the camera? Take this one out. I can't wait till I'm done. <laughs> My wrist is sweating. The moves out the way so I won't bump it. Ooh. Just the thought of having rhinestones everywhere. Like, oh, it's a mess. Put these back so I won't spill them. And I'm going to hit and, um, You can't see nothing I'm doing. Spit in there. Got all this from Big Boys Bling. Check out Big Boys Bling on Etsy. Whew. That's done. Let's cut this out and just do it right this time. Go ahead and just lay this thing on here, let it fall. And then the CEO will be next, and I'll be done. Okay, I'm just gonna lay it down. I can, I can, I'm gonna lay it down, forget it. <laughs> I'm scared. Now I'm scared. Now I'm scared. Okay. Whew, Jesus, thank you. Okay, none of them moved. Yay, we did it! Second time around. So thumbs up for me, thumbs up for me. Hearts, purple hearts, I did. <laughs> now we can just leave this here. We ain't gonna deal with this yet, but go ahead and just throw these rhinestones on here because we can peel this off later, okay? Let's go ahead and throw these rhinestones on the CEO. Black. Sorry, get away from my computer. Put it back right here. Leave that here until we finish this. I ain't trying to even deal with that right now. Black. Let's do the O first. Maybe it's better to do one letter at a time. <laughs> this is a big letter. Okay. Oh, okay. Black, come on in. Black. Can y'all see that? I'm sorry if y'all say anything on my video, on my comments. I'm sorry I'm not reading that yet. I'm trying to get this video over with. I don't want to be here all day doing the same thing. No. <laughs> okay, so we did the O. Okay, see if we can do the E. What are you just talking about? Okay, E, come through. But I'm still trying to, you can see this real good. You can see the holes real good on the camera because it's white in the background. You got the black on there, so you can see how many I have to let do, do over. <sighs> I don't want to do it.
Okay. Um, let me try it one more time. Should I try it again or just put the, go ahead and put the holes, put the thing on there with the, with the um, pencil? That's a lot of holes. But if I do it over again, it might be better. But I'm not sure. Don't know. Oh, I've got silver. I don't want that silver one in there. So should I roll it and do it again or should I just leave it like that and just put the holes on there? This my, I might get better if I do it one more time. What y'all think? You're doing great. Thank you for the compliments. She said, I'm hollering. What you hollering for? I'm over here talk, going crazy. <laughs> Thank you, crap. <Crackle. laughs> when I get it, ooh, Lord, when I get in my little, in my head, I go crazy. Like, no. So what I'm doing now, y'all can't see that either. I'm just basically brushing these in here like this. I'm gonna try to see over again. Just because trying to save time. Thanks for rocking with me, y'all. I'm just gonna do the see over because I don't want to if I I'm scared if I keep on putting this on here, it'll make take more hold out. <laughs> it'll mess mess it up more. So I'm just trying to see and be done with it. It did better, I think. <laughs> Whatever. 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 Got a lot of wipes I gotta fix, y'all. So let me go ahead and start. I'm the dang right here. I'm about to rub this on my shirt a little bit. Maybe that'll get the make it make it stick a little bit better. Here we go. Oh shoot. No, we ain't. Let's wipe these out the way. Okay. Come on, let's go. Good angle. Okay, come on. How was your trip? How was your trip, Dimps? You went somewhere. <sighs> Hope you had fun. I'm going to Vegas next week in because my brother's birthday, so we're gonna drive to Vegas. So I won't be doing a live next Sunday. I won't be doing a video next Sunday because I'll be in Vegas, y'all. We need a little break, a little vacation. My brother's birthday. I'm the oldest. He's we six months, we nine months apart. <laughs> That's funny. Um, so he's gonna have a birthday in April. My birthday is in June. So Vegas, here we come. Okay, this is working a little better than it was last time. I'm just basically trying to drag it off, like you told, just drag it off. But I'm so used to using it on my cups. I just, if I push it on the glue, because it's glue, you know what I'm saying? When you do cups, you're poking the rhinestones on the glue. Here, it's not glue. It's just on the back of your, um, of this plastic cutting thing. So it's not, you know, nothing to stick. But it's so much easier when you got glue on the back of it. Of the, um, you're sticking the glue, when you're sticking the uh, rhinestones on the glue. So much faster. Like I said, I can do a cup in no time. That's why it's soothing. Because it's, it's soothing to me to do a cup or a glass or a wine glass because... It just comes out so cre you can create, you know, what you want with different colors, um, rhinestones. But I don't use these small ones. I use the bigger ones. And they not hot. These are hot, or is it heat or hot flex? Or, um, these basically have heat on the back of them. So when you put on a shirt, it sticks to the shirt. But the ones you use on the, um, the mugs and the tumblers, cups or whatever, wine glasses, you have to um, put glue on the the vinyl first and then put the beads on it because them beads, them stones don't have the glue on it, okay? These are called hot fix. Okay? And the other ones you use on you don't use hot fix for your um for your um tumblers and stuff like that or your wine glasses because they not you're not using heat, you're just using glue. You'll be using glue, okay? So check out the video about the, my wine glasses. And my my mugs. I love doing those. I love it. <laughs> It's a different type of love for this right here. Uh, let's see. Now, also, I did a rhinestone tumbler for one time. I thought I would never do it again. I did it for my, I did it one time, and I don't know if I did that thing. All that, all that effort and all that uh, time I took to do that, I don't have that tumbler anymore. I think I left it in Ohio, but I do have a video <laughs> of me making it, but I don't have the tumbler. 
That was, oh my God. But it was kind of fun to do, just basically, it's like a little puzzle. You put these rhinestones, just lining them up. It was, it was kind of fun. It was, it was a long, it took a couple days to do it. But I did it, put in the video and I cut it up and I edited the video to make it look like it was, you know, it was worth it. But I do a lot of stuff just to do videos so I can show y'all how to do things. I love teaching and explaining and showing. That's why I love this channel. I can just find out how to do something and I'll show y'all how to do it. But I also learn from YouTube. Nothing I don't do. Well, sometimes I have to put my mind to and do something, stuff by myself. <laughs> But most of the stuff I learned from YouTube. YouTube is TV for me. I go on, I rather watch YouTube videos than watch uh, sitcoms on TV. Some of my shows I've been watching, though, it's been kind of cool lately. But usually I'm on YouTube, y'all, watching different videos. I've learned to, like, I mean, I know a lot of people, well, met a lot of people who are not, they haven't met me because I see them on Facebook, I mean, YouTube. But I've learned. Oh, I, I have met some people on, on Facebook, I mean on YouTube, so, pretty fun. Not really personally meet, but like talking on, you know, Messenger or on the phone. Pretty cool. But anybody in, uh, where am I at? <laughs> Is anybody in Phoenix? Shoot. I'm in Phoenix. Arizona. Let's do a meetup if you're here. Learn about crafting and just go and get something to eat. I like to eat. Okay, y'all. Whew, Jesus, take the wheel. Now I have the whole O to do and a little bit more E to do and we'll be done. Who's still here? Who's still rocking with me? Let me see your purple hearts. If you're here from the beginning of the video. <laughs> if you've been here from the beginning of the video, let me see your purple hearts. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying. Uh, okay. Whew. I got the O to do. Y'all probably telling me something. Y'all probably saying, Charmaine, you could have did this. Charmaine, you could have did that. Let me see what y'all saying. I'm still here. This dang don't thing don't want to stay up. I think. Let me see what y'all talking about real quick. Oh, I got the, the, the thing that's on again. Whew, big boy still here. Thank you. <laughs> and I know Dim's still here. You don't have to press hard. I don't, Dim. I try not to. You don't want to. The way to stick to your stone. Let me try to do a little softer. Thank you for the tip. Hello, dear Charmaine. Straight out of Las Vegas. Yes, I'm going to Vegas next week. Hey. Okay, let's see. Okay, y'all been quiet because y'all been watching me. So let's go ahead and finish this one so I can get out of here. Now I just don't want to come back down for me. Okay. Oh. Okay. So let's see. Let's do what Dem said. Don't. I, I didn't think I was doing too light, but let me see. Let me go lighter. See? Let's go lighter. Okay, then. I got a heavy hand. I see that I'm trying to get the uh, okay, much better be I see. I got like two thousand more holes to go. No, I'm just play. This is not working for me. I'm not going fast like I wanted to go. I'm gonna be picking up stones. <sighs> Kumbaya, my lord, kumbaya. <laughs> oh, no, I can't do this. My patience, I have, good, I have patience, y'all, but not with this, I don't. I really don't get too flustered. These things right here. See, I like this better. Drop them in here. Uh, I'm trying to 
trying to get this one. He's running away from me. Uh, checked out. Um, I also make clothes, y'all. Um, I make baby clothes. Like little skirts and two, two skirts. Check out a Ray of Sunshine Boutique on Etsy. It's, on, it's below also. Um, my daughter, she makes wood signs. That's Shade Designs on Facebook. It's all in the family. My daughter, I'm so happy she found something that she love to do. But my, I have a grandson now. And it's so hard finding boy clothes to make him. I, just, I feel so bad that I didn't even make him that many things. I made him a jacket with embroidery on it. I made him a shirt outfit. Um, jeans with a shirt to match it. I want to make some more stuff. And, uh, girl stuff is so pretty. There's so much out there to choose from. Oh my God. This crack right here in this table is going to be the devil. Because I'm just falling. Bleeds falling everywhere. Stones. Rhinestones. That looks like a door. I want to see. This is my first time using black. So I want to see how these things bling. Bling, bling. I just, I was pulling away from black. And now I'm going to use it. And maybe I'll be like, okay, then black, pull through. I like. But I've seen people do rhinestones. I have, I think I've had shirts that I bought with black rhinestones. So I just don't see. It just, it just, it's no, it just sounds, you know, si not silly or unusual to have black bling, you know, because it's so dark. But I see a bling right now. It's blinging. So, and it's crazy because I've done a lot of black on my mugs and tumblers. So, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'll be talking out of my face. Because <laughs> I've used a lot of black on my, my, my um, wine glasses and stuff when I make them. So, it's just different for shirts for me, I guess. I don't know. I'll be making stuff up because I talk. <laughs> uh, comedian. Okay. I like the way the... Um, I prefer to use the um the tweezers. So when I say that it messed up. They popping all over the place now. But yeah. Tweezers are better for me. With these little rhinestones. Okay, so these tweezers came in the pack with my um uh starter kit from Big Boys. He get it's a whole lot of stuff. Check out what I just show you what he give you for the starter starter um Starter kit for bling bling starter kit. Okay. And he also do, he also, um, if you're not into blinging, well, you probably are because you're watching the video, but if you're into DTF, you also have the, um, the stuff you need for DTF. Um, the, I bought my, I purchased, well, he also, um, yeah, I, I purchased some, um, his, his ink is the bomb. And his powder, DTF powder is the bomb. Um, check him out. And y'all, my DTF machine, oh my God. I got black black ink spreaded all over the place. So I think my, it got backed up from the back of the machine, the black from the back of whatever. So I just have to get the, the uh, patience <laughs> to figure it out. I mean, I, the people, I got Pro Color machine. I have a pro cover machine so I can go and uh, Skype them and they can show me how to do it. But just having the time to sit down and have them do that. Because I need to get my detail machine back up and running. And then I blew a fuse. Keep it real. I blew a fuse in my, um, y'all see? There's two more left, y'all. I blew a fuse in my doggone heater. They sent me the, the fuse for the heater, but I just didn't put it in there yet because I don't have the patience to do that either. <laughs> so, uh. I gotta get that stuff together so I can get my DTF machine. Hopefully, y'all can encourage me and say, Charmaine, do it. Uh, but that black ink got me all scared. There's black ink everywhere. But they told me how to do it. They just told me to clean it with alcohol, wipe it down with a Q-tip. They really helpful. But they told me that about a month ago, and I still ain't did it yet. So we got it done, y'all. Let's get these beads out the way and then slap that stuff on there. Slap that stuff on there. I'm gonna <laughs> slap the uh, transfer tape on top of there. And we're going to put this on the heating machine. I mean, my shirt. I'm sorry. I'm hungry. Can't talk on that stomach. I'm just putting it in here like that. Sorry if I'm off the camera, y'all. Okay. I can stay here for a minute. I ain't got time. Hey, look, anything. 
these. Okay, so let me cut my um, transfer paper. Tra transfer tape. This is still too small, so I'm going to use that. We can always use this later for something else. This is done. Let me see. Do I got all my spots? Yes, I do. Oh, what's this? Is that two? Yep, there's two of them. I can see a little bit, y'all. Okay, let me get this out the way. See how good that picks up? Okay. So now I'm just going to take, cut it. That be Y'all can see me I'm trying to get stay on the camera as much as I can, but it's hard to stay on the camera. <laughs> okay, y'all. <sighs> patience, patience, patience. Make perfect. Let's see. Just drop that thing down. And let it go. And let it go. <laughs> okay, they all stuck. Baby, baby, baby. Thank you, Jesus, for taking the wheel because I sure didn't have it. <laughs> okay. The hard part is over. Yay. Sorry for trimming y'all here. Oh, I see. I got a stone. That's, um, there was too many stones there, but it's fine. You can always pick that up later. That black is nice though. <laughs> on that blue. Let's see how it's gonna look on that purple on that pink. Okay. So let's take off the certified. Put it right here. Let's talk to everybody, y'all. Let's go ahead and do the certified first. Ooh, let's see, stick it to the table. Okay, so let's see. Certified is right here. Let's watch me take it off. We did it, y'all. Thanks for y'all help. Thanks for watching and thanks for. <laughs> Watch me jack up stuff. So, okay, see, look at that. Kind of came off. I don't see no stones. It's not coming off, but that's cool. See, the hard part is getting them stones on there. Everything else is easy, okay? Putting in a shirt is going to be easy as long as my eyes are straight and I can make sure everything is straight on the shirt. But that takes me a minute to figure out, you know, make sure everything's straight on the shirt. This is my shirt, so I ain't about to be even taking y'all time up trying to make it perfect because it's my shirt, okay? So this is going, going to go up here. Let's go ahead and rub this a little bit because there's a lot of stones on here. Okay, rub with my hands a little bit. Use a brush, use a roller, you use whatever you want, but the heat is good with your hands. I don't know why my pressure it didn't beep. I thought it did beep. Okay, so, so now let's take this off. Sorry, my hands in the way, but this is how I have to do it. No black left behind. <laughs> okay. Yay! So now let me get that one stone that I said I needed to take off. I'm going to take this off right now while I'm sitting here looking at it. And where's my teaser? Just one little stone that it was so many of them. Take it off. Oh, I should use my little. Easier to use this one. You want to get it. Dang, stuck. Just playing around because it's on that glue. Okay. So that's it. Put on the back of this like so. Put this out the way. Okay, so now I have, oh, I said, okay, 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 okay. now I have my CEO, let me see, oh, it's not moving y'all, so I'm gonna stick a, let me, let me zoom my camera back out, here we go, I have my CEO, and my certified, and my she, and my she, okay. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take it to the heat press, but I think I'm gonna cut these down some because even though I really want to use these this over again, but it might not never work again. I'm gonna cut it down because if the shorter it is, the better it'd be able to put on the shirt. So I'm gonna cut this around, cut this off a little bit. This sheet is way too big. I mean it's too much paper. I'm just cut it around so I won't have to worry about all that extra in my way to put on the shirt. Cause we gotta, we gotta uh basically what's it called? We have to basically layer it, okay? Let's cut some of this off. There we go. And look at this. Put this away. Because we're going to use it over and over again to different shirts, different rhinestones. Put that away. We're going to use it over again. Okay? Uh, my craft room is a mess. Leave me over here at the um, heat press so we can get this shirt done, y'all. Okay. 
First, I got my shirt. Is that a good view, y'all? Here we go. I am starving like Marvin, y'all. I'm going to go get some oh, I got somewhere to go at 3 o'clock. I'm going to get something to eat. I got to eat. I got to eat. This shirt's from Walmart. <laughs> it's my shirt. Because I make it for myself. I'm going to go ahead and heat press it. Oh, lint roll it first. I'm make sure that glue stick on there. Then get the heat, get that lint, the lint roll. I'm sorry if you are asking any questions right now. I can't see the, the screen right now, but I'm going to look at it after I get this done, okay? I'll answer your questions when I get done with this. Is this thing really working? Okay. Y'all hear my son in the background screaming? He's he on this game. He's so dang on loud. Oh, my battery going low? Are you kidding me? Dang it. Shoot. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay, my phone is going low. My son may not can't hear me, so I'm gonna have him go get my charger for my phone. I'm gonna let this heat up for a little bit. Keep knocking my hold on, see. Tell my son to come here. Come here, Shay. Come here. Sorry, y'all. I'm scared my ear. Oh, that thing heavy. Really break one of your fingers if you got in the way. Okay, well, he pressed my shirt. Go get my charger for me. My phone I'm about to go dead. Um, so now I'm going to center this. Uh, how I want it. So it's certified. Let me look at the picture again. Okay, certified CEO. Looking at the picture so I can make sure I do it right. So what you need to do is Make sure it's straight. I'm gonna take this off now. See, here's the um, rhinestone. I'm gonna take off the white part, the backing of it, and just let it um release itself. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna set this on here. I'm gonna go three inches from the uh from the um top. Three, yeah, three inches. So let me just check and see if it's three inches. So three. Oh, oh shoot. Let's see. I'm going to do two because it's my shirt and I got the CEO to go down there too. So I'm mm, a little bit lower. I'll be hard headed. Do it how I want to do it. So let me see. This is three. It's two and a half inches. Now basically I go from here. That's about four right here. I hope y'all can see that. Four from the um that side. and Oh, that's not four. It's a little bit off. I'm going to go over some over here. Plastic, we just take the stickiness be in the way of me being great. Three and a half. So now it's a little bit right here. And this, over here, it's perfect. That's perfect. That's straight. <laughs> okay, that's fine. So now I'm going to go ahead and he press this. Oh, I can do I can do two at the same time. So that's uh, certified. I'm gonna put CEO under it. Since it's not nothing um, on top of that, so I'm gonna go ahead and put the CEO under it. I should have cut this off a little bit. Well, that's fine. Leave it like that. Take this off. No. Excuse me. Because dang. I leave the plastic on. <laughs> Okay, so I'm taking the CEO off, bringing it on here. So I'm gonna put it about. Uh, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this later. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it later. Y'all got me all messed up. I got my stuff all messed up. Okay, heat it for 345 for 12 seconds. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm all over the place. This videos. Okay, so I did 3.45 for 12 seconds with my Teflon paper. I just blew a freaking fuse. It's over with, y'all. The fuse is blown. The video's over with. I'm going to have to do another video later because my fuse is blown. I got the certified on there. My son must have 
turned on something in the house. I just moved here from Ohio, so the fuse box is not that great here. So the fuse is blown. So what I'm gonna just show y'all what I'm gonna do after this, and then the video's gonna be over because I can't do anything else. Hold up, Shane! He must have turned the microwave on to something. Because this heat press ain't no joke. It takes a lot of power out of these um heat presses. And I'm not used to this because I'm when I was in Ohio, I had my house, I had everything done, I had electric. I did new electric in my house and everything, and I ended up going through a divorce, moving. So now I was like, start all over. So sometimes it's good to start over, keep on your face. But today is not the day for me. So um, next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show y'all that I can't do it because I'm gonna turn this off and um, be done because my head hurt now. I'm gonna put the CEO right here. Okay, and then I'm gonna go ahead and he pressed that for another um, was it 3:45 for 12 seconds? 3:45 for 12 seconds. Yes, and then I take the plastic off of there. Then I put the sheet on top of it. Then I he pressed it again. But I put the sheet right here in the middle of there, which would be like right here. Okay, and then I'll be done with the shirt. This it will look like this when it's done. Okay, but like I said. Then a fuse is blue. My heat press is out. I could have still used the heat press because it's still hot, but I'm not about to do that. I'm about to just go ahead and um, shut this video down and um, finish the shirt Ugh. after my um, electricity. After I go fix my fuse, so I do want to keep pressing. She said keep on pressing, but I don't know how to. Let me go ahead because I didn't. I just count 15 seconds. Okay, let me go ahead and keep pressing. I'm over here shaking now. Okay, CEO. Oh, I'm shaking. I'm hot. Okay, so certified CEO, go right here. It's still hot. This thing is super hot, though. Is that close enough? Yeah, certified in the middle. Okay. Let's make sure this is straight, y'all. It's certified like it's cricket. Let me hurry up because it is hot, but it's it is, I mean it don't take that much heat really. I mean it does, but it ain't gonna take that long for me to press this. Um see I uh, hope that's straight, y'all, uh, but I'm about to put the Teflon paper back on there. Fifteen seconds. One. Two. Okay. Oh, I came back on. My my son must have went on down there too. <laughs> he not told him how to do the fuse. This ain't the first time this happened, y'all. So he must have went down there and put the fuse back on. But like I said, I'm here in Arizona, and it's so many times that the dang on fuse went out by itself. Like down here, they've having some accidents down here, so I don't know if it, it had to. I don't know if it was me with the heat press or if it was somebody out of us outside and hit a pole. But if somebody would have hit a pole, it'd been out way longer than this. But girl, I, girl, I've been here for like seven months, and my electricity power went out two times already. So, but I probably he probably knew that he blew a fuse. Cause he playing his game and he know he wanna play his game, so he went on there and went on here to fix it. <laughs> well, thanks, son, for bringing me back to life. But well, even though I didn't need it, because y'all told me to go ahead and keep on going. So, but he presses back on and it's still on the right pressure. So whatever he do, don't do it again, Shane. And I know y'all nephew Shane be on one. Okay, so let's see. I'm just trying to place this sheet the way I want it to be placed and how it is on the screen that I'm looking at. Oh, shoot, the S goes right here, okay? The H go right here. Oh, that looks kind of weird. Okay, let me let me look at the picture. The E goes right here, the she. What in the world? Oh, that goes not right here. Oh, how did this go? Looking at the picture and this don't even match. Oh, 
They don't even match. Hmm. <sighs> Let's see. Let's see. The S goes right here. Oh, there it is. Okay. There we go. So that's those these these right here is over. This should not should not be doing that. In the picture, it has the uh oh it's going like this. Just, you, you should not be touching rhinestones on top of rhinestones. And this is showing me I'll be, I'll be touching rhinestones on top of rhinestones. This is not adding up, y'all. And I know I, when I printed it out, I printed it out the right way. But it's not showing me that I printed it out the right way. It's not going on there right. Let's see. But see, let me show y'all what I'm saying. This, this, this right here, these, these rhinestones up here is, is touching... These rhinestones up here. Oh my goodness! This that's why, Charmaine. I'm calling myself a dumb. This is too close. I should have had a space between. I should have brought it down some. So, oh well, it's my shirt. It's cool. But let me show y'all before it. I cannot wait till this video is over with. Sorry. See how the um word, and this is. A little space between there but now since i don't have that space this right here is gonna be touching my r but i'm gonna do it i'm gonna just cut it i'm gonna cut that that, that line off because it's my shirt so i'm gonna just cut that top of that um h off okay no i'm not tired but this is the worst video i've ever done in my life i ain't never had a video like this i'm not even tired i'm just frustrated and um my patience is gone because of these vine things got me looking, going crazy but i'm gonna cut the h off real quick I'm not sleepy. I'm just frustrated. And things get like that sometimes, I guess. Uh, let's see. And then I just dropped the phone because I took it off my uh, tripod and it just fell. So let's see. So I'm going to leave it like this. That's cool. And I'm going to just cut the H off so I can see how much the H I have to cut off. Okay. This is not matching up at all, though. It don't even matter if the um, if I cut the itch off, it's still not matching up, and I don't know why. Maybe I printed it wrong, cause it's not matching up. And I've seen a video that said that you have to, you should take your rhinestones and you should um, make sure they fit by look when you in Cricut, you get like a little uh, uh, a little circle and you make sure they fit. But I get the size they told me to do. But I'm going to be able to do this design, this design again because it's not fitting. Even if I did bring the CEO down, unless this spine right here is not supposed to be here. Let's see. Um, This is the, oh, oh, this rhinestone wasn't supposed to be here, that's why. Okay. This is the rhinestone. Let's take it off. There you go. Perfect. So I can use this again. I'm just looking to see. Oh, and this, this wasn't, it's a missing the rhinestone. These are missing right here. It's supposed to be right on my picture. I'm looking at the picture. It's supposed to be two black rhinestones right here. And this is, um, it's gone right here. But then the space I, I made, it was just, I should have brought, brought it down somewhere. Okay, so I'm going to cut this off so it won't overlap. Now just keep that rhinestone there. I don't need this rhinestone these rhinestones so cut this off so I won't overlap my other one see i'm learning y'all i make mistakes but i still learn bring this over you can you can really fix it up make it work so this is perfect i can use this again because it's working now i just gotta i'm gonna add two black stones right here because it must have not make a hole in my rhinestone it must have make the hole because it's not there I thought it's supposed to be connected to this and it's not supposed to be connected, so it's fine. Okay, so I'm gonna get two rhinestones to put right here in the little spot right here. And we are going to be okay. I just probably just need one. 
I'm sorry, my hands are shaking, y'all. Ah. I'm hot. This damn heat press is hot. Okay, one rhinestone right there. Your mind, I can't see what I'm doing. I'm sorry. But I'm just putting, I'm just adding the rhinestone there because it needed to be rhinestone there. Now it's perfect. I don't know why no two rhinestones is there. That shouldn't even, that shouldn't even been there. Oh yeah, it matched. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. So now, ooh, what the heck I do? Did I already do this? Oh. <laughs> I'm doing a she now. I'm like, oh, I did this already. So now I'm going to do another 35, 345 degrees for 12 seconds, okay? Guess what, y'all? This is the last pressing. Guess what, y'all? This video about to be over with. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for this blooper video, okay? I've been doing this COVID. I've never had a video like this before on YouTube, okay? Never have I ever, but things always happen. I'm not perfect, and thanks for rocking with me. Who's on here still? I have 30 people, 35 people watching. You get away, have way more. So, y'all got tired of me. I understand, okay? I understand, y'all. Y'all couldn't hang with me, but the ones that hung with me, I appreciate y'all. Thanks for teaching us. Thanks for staying with me from day one, from um, from the first minute I came on. Shout out to big boy. I'm about to see how this bling bling blinging. Okay. Oh my goodness, y'all. At least I had a good shirt and I kept on going. I didn't stop. So the shirt is nice. Came out nice. That black is blinging. Okay. That black is blinging. Certified she e c e o. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. So I'm gonna be selling these shirts on my um, web on my Etsy page. I'm about to go get something to eat. Take a breather, boosta, everything else I need to do. Thank you for all the compliments. Thank you, thank you, thank you for sticking around with me. Hey, best unit, cute. Um, hey, best unit. I gotta look some of your videos too. I've been meaning to, I couldn't find you, but I'm gonna have to go find some videos. I know they told me that you do bling too. So I've been looking for your girl. But uh, thank shout out to Big Boy. Check out him on Etsy, Big Boy Prince. Etsy, I got the bling from him. That black, I was scared to use it because I ain't know. I'm not saying his stuff ain't gonna bling. I'm just saying I never used bling before. I never did a bling shirt before with black. Never did a bling shirt before. Just, just my only my second one doing it. And look at that black. It's blinging. Let me turn the sun. Let me get some sun on in here. Nice, nice, nice. I love it. I'm just saying something in the camera. Little gap right here. That was my fault. But other than that. And that's what I'm saying. It's so tedious to do, but look at it. It came out perfect how I just cut that. Um, Because I basically, next time I'm bringing the CEO down some and that, that H should come up a little bit, it'll be much, much better. But it's perfect. I added my two little stones right there. So this, you can critique this a little bit. You can add more things to it, more stones if you needed to. Um, and it, that glue on top of them, the glue on back of the stones, make it work for you. So if I want to add more, I could add more. You know what I'm saying? If I want to put more here, you know what I'm saying? I could do whatever. Them rhinestones are the bomb. Look at this. Look at the sparkle. Look at it. Look at it. Okay. Thanks for watching, y'all. I appreciate y'all. Thanks, Stimps, for handling it, holding it down for me, like always. And y'all have a good night. Have a good Sunday. Be blessed. And my phone didn't go off, y'all. <laughs> my electricity went out, but my phone didn't go out. Thank God. Good night.